when um, when you're finished uh, when you're finished with your cranes, you have to put them your strings of cranes. You have to put the, the strings of cranes in the uh, in the box, and it's important that you put them in in a very special way. And that is to start at one corner of the box. I'm going to I'm going to start up at this corner here, and declaring that that's the beginning, and then putting the cranes down into the box just randomly kind of stacking them on top of each other and then putting the button through the slot in the first position we load the box in a clockwise fashion notch to notch button to button when we get into a situation of adding another crane and these are long strings you'll see them going in I always put the cranes down in the open holes at the bottom so that it stays even at the bottom dropping them in place like such. I'm actually pulling these grains out of one box and putting them in another just to demonstrate this that it really does work. So I'm going to put these cranes down if you will so that they're making a flat layer and again going clockwise notch to notch with the buttons and locking the buttons down in the notches. There we go like such and put the button down in to the notch. Again, now there's a hole in the overside, and even though I'm going to a notch on this side here, I'm going to fill the open space down in the bottom of the box so that the stack of cranes is even. Again, filling up in the holes, nice and even. And these are long strings, so I'm just pulling them out of the box. They come out easily and don't get tangled. Sometimes you can just give a little shake, not much. And then finally, here's another one right here. Again, I'm loading where there's the lowest point in the pile at the bottom and then dropping in here. Notice I've gone clockwise as I load in because when we unload them, we'll know where the start is and then we'll go un uh, counterclockwise. When you get to the last button, wherever you finish up, um, we want to put a little mark like this in that spot because that tells the person who unloads the box exactly where to start. So um, the person would come in and just so you can see that it really does work, watching how the crane comes, the string of cranes just by grabbing the button, the string of cranes just come right out of the box without getting tangled. I'm going to slip that one right back down in and secure it and again putting the marker like such in there so I know where the start point is.